Today on more. From shimmer to head to toe color, we talk trends of the Oscar red carpet and tell you who failed to walk away with an Academy Award. And cooking up spice in Hot Kitchen Online. Meet the chefs behind the website that's growing in popularity as they teach you to cook some love into your life. Plus, we're clowning around and you could soon be too. Details on how you can be one of the fun faces of this year's Rose Festival. First, live, local. More Good Day Oregon starts now. I don't know. You know what? I have no opinion on that whatsoever. But I do love the food. Right here. She graduated top of her class from Portland's Le Cordon Bleu. And now with the help of her husband, who's kind of hanging out over there in the sidelines, uh, they were teaching you how to make romantic dinners at home. I'm joined right now by Wendy. Tracy, once again, over there. Uh, Lincoln's the last name. And you're the founders of Hot Kitchen. That is right. Hot Kitchen is our baby. Okay. And what, what happens in Hot Kitchen when people go to kind of check this out? We teach people how to make romantic meals at home. Mm -hmm. And are you, are you saying that both the, uh, the the couples should work on this together and not just you in here and the little outfit working on it while he sits over the side? Well, it's always more fun when you have more hands in the kitchen. Okay, all right. And, and so you have like a maybe a demonstration of something that you can make in the kitchen that's simple and easy and, and somewhat... Uh, uh, romantic or something. You know what? Let me make sure you're. Uh, all right. That, that was that romantic. Or you? <laughs> now your mic is on. Okay. So what are we gonna make right here? Right now we're gonna make a set of flaming pears, which is a terrific dessert to share with your sweet. Oh yeah. So I've got a couple poached pears here. They have been peeled. Now how do you? How did you originally poach the pear? Right? What's the process? Right? Well, I, I peeled them mm -hmm. and I put them in white grape juice and I simmered them for about 35 minutes. Okay. And before I did that, I also took the core out, a little fruit scoop. Good idea. So we, we have the, the two poached pears yes, right there. Yes. All right. And over here we have strawberry sauce. Oh. A cup of strawberries. I cooked it down with a bit of sugar, a little bit of the white grape juice that we poached the pears mm -hmm. in. And I mashed it together until I came up with this consistency right here. So you're able to get the strawberries, and, but you know, if you could we would hold off and do this once, like the hood berries come in and they're all fresh. Oh, that and would be the best. Then they'll be even better. Oh, be so but if you can't wait, we'll go ahead and jump on with this. So we have that all in the pan right there. Now what happens? Now we add between a half ounce to a full ounce of 151 rum. Oh, my. See and that? we uh -huh. light it on all the right, fire. All right, here we go. Get ready. And, uh, oh, I see the flame. Yeah, there I we go. see it. It's blue. LA can feel the flame over here. Yep, well. yep. And you want to get it good and agitated. You want to give the sauce a couple moments to warm up in the heat of the fire. Yeah. While it's still burning, you want to pour it over the pears. Uh huh. Mm hmm. And you have. Doesn't that look good? Wow, it does. And hit it with a little bit of cinnamon. Oh, flavor. and did you see that? The sparks. Yep. Sparks are happening in the kitchen, my friends. And when the flames go out, the dessert is ready to be enjoyed. There it is. And, and that was so simple. You put that together and nothing flat. So it, it, when people watch it and see kind of your ideas, are they uh, desserts or everything? We do everything. What we offer is a, is a menu, mm -hmm. if you will, to replace that romantic meal that you used to have out. Yeah, right. Instead of going out, you know, kind of yeah, yeah. economic downturn, you go in there. Uh, so, and, and how do people uh, get into watching so you guys? It's online, right? Yes. We're online at hotkitchenonline.com. Mm -hmm. You can also watch us locally in Portland Friday nights, 10 o'clock, channel 11. Okay. We also have other show times that are called out on our website. We show in San Francisco and we podcast through iTunes for free. Wow, so there's lots of different things. And just uh, back your mind, I know this wasn't uh, set up ahead of time. How many different uh, recipes do you have on there so far that people can kind of go through? Goodness, well, we have over 50 episodes okay. posted right now, and there's between three to six recipes wow. per episode. So you've got practically a, a, a full year of, uh, of romantic right. meals to put together right That's there right. throughout the whole time. I love it. Uh, we have actually linked Hot Kitchen online to kptv.com slash more. And uh, can, can I try this? Please, please. Is it, is, is it, it's not going to burn me, right? Oh, no. Okay, no, no. Just flames are out. A little bit of pear. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Moss, get over here. Try a little bit yes, of this. Come on over. Yeah. Yeah. Here, is that too big of a bite for you? You want to open up there? And I'll give that. Mmm. <laughs> Mm. Mm. There you go. Good. Stay tuned. We'll be right back. That is outstanding. You're carrying me just watching the studio, too. <laughs> You're watching more Good Day Oregon.